that we gave her. Yeah. I should get some water. <laughs> you think? <laughs> now that I've become a stereotype. <laughs> Can you believe it? Exactly, my own body has betrayed me. I suppose I betrayed it first. No. Yeah. Okay, yeah, there's something wrong. <laughs> A lot of the time when that happens, it's just that somebody else had, has gotten it before. Oh, because it happened like five times in a row? Yeah. No, I'm saying it happened five different people I tried summoning. No, that's what I mean. Is This is a fucking hot spot. And if you don't grab them instantly, like, sometimes they're, like... Dude, you better get that water away from my left up. That is not a good spot to put the water. Wow, it, it really isn't. It's, <laughs> it's <laughs> tilted! It's, tilted. <laughs> it's literally tilted! Oh my god! You're tilted. Do you want no, me to hold you your water? Tilted, Do you sir. want me to hold your water? We are all tilted here. I will hold your water. Do you oh, want me cool. to I'm hold- I'm good, I'm good. Look at I'm holding my water. Oh, we shared a hug. This is only the beginning. Plenty of more memories. Plenty of more. I invented an entire <laughs> word to put there. Plenty more memories for us down the road. Memories to make and stuff to break. Let's fucking do it. Hell yeah, bro. World's yeah. best dad. You are damn right. You're probably going to have to pay for most of it. That's fine because I have a high paying job. Uh, what is it we do again? We were like a roadie or something. We got royalties though, I'm sure. The band liked us. <laughs> royalties for a roadie. That's it's... generous. We were the favorite roadie. Favorite roadie. Yeah. We have a trophy that says favorite roadie. We do. It would be my honor to pay for everything that you break. Amanda hops up. Hops up where? It's um, our, like, hops up, like, from sitting. I thought we were hugging her. Uh, we actually, it didn't glitch out for a se like, we glitched out for a second. We fucked up. Somehow. Like, the internet crapped out. Oh, uh, beneath our cherry blossom tree. Yeah, we have one of those. It's incredibly dramatic that we, like, I feel like we planted this just for this moment. Probably. Which, rad. Man, maybe, hey, Zephu. What? Oh my god, are you about to ask? Cl what kind of climates do cherry trees thrive in? We could have an anime in our backyard. <laughs> Whoa, whoa, the Emmas, what happened? Whoa, I feel like there's a part of the plot we missed. Whoa, whoa, no, whoa, whoa. she's probably about to explain it. If you click the X button. Uh, oh. I thought they weren't your, what? God, that's, look at our landscaping, it's immaculate. That almost makes me want to hire a landscaper. Yeah, they also have a koi pond, it looks like. Like, if there are koi in there, I'm going to shit myself. <laughs> Don't. Be ready. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know that I did anything in that fight. It's fine. CD CD those CD <laughs> boys! You enabled it. This is how it has come full circle. English, the English language comes full circle because the, the terms CD boys. <laughs> I'm gonna start calling benches that. Has full circle come from Victorian era back to modern era because a hundred percent someone has said that. I think Damien is fucking with us. <laughs> Becca just made a fucking meteor shower happen. 
in Elden Ring. That's rad. Everything's rad right now. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Cherry blossoms, shooting stars. So romantic all around. <laughs> CD boys. CD it has boys. everything. Why do you have a name tag on everybody in this gold that like knows who you are? Straight from work. Pro yeah, literally, probably just came from work. If you have, there, there is a grace around somewhere, and I'm going to pick up my empty dead body yeah. just so it gets off the map. Yeah. I had a revelation the other day, Stan. Is it like, listen, okay. Is it a personal revelation or is it like a revelations revelation? Because those are two very different oh, things. I mean, and the first like and the second we're... one I'm gonna have to sit down on this CD boy for. I have a feeling it's prepared. gonna be the former rather than the latter. My true form. With all the powers that it You're making that IT money. I'm not upset about that. Aww. Hell yeah. Off, that's the dash. <laughs> yes! And I thought want and need you. Wait, that doesn't make sense. <laughs> I want you and need you and I'm a thought for you. I kind of got there in the end, I guess. I'll give it to you. I thought that was pretty clever. I think you think just about anything is pretty clever right now. Hmm. Feeling constricted by what I thought was my personal brand made me lose sight of why I did this in the first place. To make myself happy. Please still be happy being a goth. <laughs> Yours is the only interesting house in this cul-de-sac. Please, I will support you, 100%. No, listen, your garden is beautiful and your house is beautiful, and please don't change them, for the love of God. <laughs> oh, that's what we're talking about. Dog goth. Hello. Nope. I wasn't sure if you'd need to reload the area to get him or if not. You're going to regret it in the morning. Probably. <laughs> not even probably. <laughs> Me too, Stan. You did more than I did. You of course, he has a good hair care routine. And Brian comes up and is like, Hey, do you know how many dudes I've romanced? Like 20. Shut the fuck up, I Brian. caught, I romanced a dude <laughs> this big. <laughs> Listen, my hair is pretty soft. So many products. But yours is so soft. Conditioner, bro. Invest in it. I stand the man Van Halen absolutely conditions, but this man's hair is on a whole nother level. <laughs> no way. Way. Where's Amanda? Where is all the rest of the dads? Did they they left. This is later in the party. And she just went to hang out with her friends. It told us that. He did goth magic on them and they disappeared. <laughs> it's not how that works. Okay, fine. He did goth magic on them and they were teleported to another place if you want to be you're, pedantic about you're it. You're fucking no, stupid. If anything, he's doing goth magic to just like make them a bubble. To be he did goth magic and turned them into bats. <laughs> or, or... Contrary point, they all got up and fucking left the backyard. <laughs> Unrealistic. <laughs> Blocked. <laughs> fucking stupid. <laughs> You've been canceled. I can't wait to listen to this later and be embarrassed by all the jokes I made that I thought were funny at the time. <sighs> yeah, man, let's do a scandal. 
Uh, uh. Cute as fuck. AF. Well, we finished a route. Look at that. Yay. I don't. S wait. Yes? No. Oh, okay. Oh Never mind. Okay. Oh, Joseph is voiced by Aaron. And Robert is voiced by Dan. Which one is voiced by Aaron? I already for uh, Robert, I think. Robert and Joseph are voiced by Aaron and Dan. Mm. You sure about that? Yes. I'm sure of which... I'm not sure which one is voiced by which, but I'm sure that Joseph and... Robert are voiced by Aaron and Dan. You can't expect me to remember things past five seconds. Penguin minigame, dad battle minigame, radio minigame. We played the dad battle minigame. Piano whittling ski ball. Boy, there's a lot of minigames we haven't seen. Golf one we did. Wait. Fishing minigame. Concert. We did concert. Gargoyle we did. Running we did. The falling star? It is not actually. I can tell you where it is. Where is it? Wait, what? That's not at all where it looked like it was headed. I don't know. Ballad of a Fallen Dad. Daughter Brag Battle Theme. Test company, please ignore. You can't tell me what to do or wait. Maybe this is reverse psychology. Jory Griffiths, I feel like they switched the G and the J in your name. Guinevere Saint Ange is a great name and all of our dads a game from game grumps piano whittling oh look at how unamused we look press X to continue drinking too much water can cause water intoxication Oh shit! <laughs> look at that smooth motherfucker. Smooth as fuck! Let's look at that smooth father fucker, because technically that's yeah. really. Yeah. That's accurate. Let's not be heteronormative. Absolutely not. Being straight's overrated. Wow, that was incredibly close. Yeah. Sometimes. Not sometimes, all the time. I wish. That I were less straight. <laughs> you don't want to join the fruity bandwagon? Listen, I'd love to, but my heart's just not in it. Can't relate. What about your heart, honey? <laughs> Do, dick isn't in it either. Yeah, my dick isn't in it either. <laughs> your dick wouldn't be in it. <laughs> oh, now that you've finished one, his portrait's colored in. Oh, yeah, so it is. His portrait is colored in. Sefu made an astute observation. She has. Uh, okay, so where is it? Uh, uh, do you want to do yeah, another this, this thing? Whole area was not like we can that do a little bit more. more. I'm still waiting on my laundry. It's got like another uh, uh, 40, <laughs> 50 minutes. Continue. Uh, yeah, so just close around until you find a way down. Uh, what happens if we load the epilogue? I don't know what is happening. If we do this, I don't know how new be I don't know how new game plus works in this. Oh, it's just the credits. Okay. Go. 
Moth is a portmanteau of gay and moth. I would play a video game about a gay moth. What are you, are you, are you humming we didn't start the fire? No. <laughs> okay, then I'm I'm sorry. humming Mountain of the Sun by Greta Van Fleet. Mm -hmm. Okay. Are you debating whether I'm telling the truth or not? No, no, no. I was, he said, mm hmm. Likely no, story. That wasn't meant to be. You got caught being a Billy Joel fan. You don't want to own up to it. I mean, I don't like. I'm sorry. I like Billy Joel. We just had to fire another, another piece. I, I totally understand we what you about, mean. We don't talk about I totally that don't. That shit's awful. I am in total agreement with you. But it's disappointing because Billy Joel is such a good artist, and then he has that song. That's epilogue, just a literally epilogue, epilogue. a bunch of bullshit names. So it's, it's literally well, it's a bunch of historical references through decades. So it's yeah. kind of cool. But it'd, it'd be a fun thing to challenge your students to do as an as a history teacher. Oh, right. that'd be red. Let's. A point for do we? Which I can't. Do we want to hang out with Craig again? Why don't we do Matt? Aren't we already on the road? His ro route a little bit. Matt. No, like. Nice there are a couple we haven't, like, I don't think we've hung out with these two yet. I'd be down to hang out with Hugo. Hugo, middle school teacher, high school teacher, writer of oh, scholarly geez. articles on 18th century literature for various esteemed publications. You didn't cite your work. F. If you're here on here to tell me that my son put a cherry bomb in your trash, I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bruce on, and paint miniatures. Miniatures of like Warhammer miniatures or like what kind of miniatures? We n we must find out what kind of miniatures he's into. Yeah. Marcel Proust. Muscles. Proust, sorry. Proust. What are your turn on some muscles? Well, too bad. What do you want to be when you grew up movie star? Too bad. Each of us read a different book on opposite sides of the couch in comfortable silence. Yeah, that's fair. Honestly. I worry that people who are against e-readers are more in love with the idea of books than actually reading them. That's, a, that's an astute observation. I, yeah, I'm down with this. I do like physical having physical books though, but I get the yeah the ease of having an e-reader. The ideas contained within are the most important part. True. Lay Miz, <laughs> Miz character miniatures, yes. Yeah. But for tactical combat simulations. <laughs> A Lay Miz Warhammer set. That would be fucking rad. For certain definitions of rad. I have a favor to ask your class is going on a field trip to the aquarium and one of our chaperones is sick. Fuck yeah. Uh fucking free trip to the aquarium literally Fuck, on yeah. the government's time yeah hell yes hell yeah I need as much help as I can get so Zephu is this a knockdown? listen I did student teaching and I enjoyed middle school teaching middle school students more than I did high school students that's a per personal preference but like don't you actually like kids, though? I mean, I don't hate them. I, uh, See, like... See, that's where we differ. Is there gonna be a great... Middle school kids or? are not, like, too cool for school yet, so they're a lot easier, like... Yeah, but I, they can be mean for the sake of being mean. I, like, they're more chill... Yeah, but they're not very sophisticated about it. Yeah. <laughs> I enjoyed uh, teaching in middle school, did student teaching in middle school a lot more than I did in high school. Amanda silently trudges into the kitchen and pours herself a bowl of cereal. We've gone back in time and she hasn't go gotten over how her friends, whose names I don't remember, betrayed her. Emma P and Emma. Oh yeah, the Emma's. Emma P, Emma R, Noah. 
And the I still can't remember the last one. I don't know her name. I don't think she's that important. Well, she obviously because she's the one that was not liked by everybody until now. Morning, Amanda. How was middle school for you? I thought we lived this. I don't even remember middle school. I've probably repressed it. <laughs> it's 12 years old. I'm rude now. <laughs> <laughs> Starting fights over, I don't know, pizza day, top 40s pop. Exactly, Amanda. I think middle gets schoolers it. are pretty rad, frankly. Nah. Like when we had free time, I would like we would do like uh, like if we had a free period where a lot of them didn't have a bunch of homework, we would do like improv skits, and they were very good at it. I don't remember. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we liked it. See, middle schoolers are reprehensible. Listen, usually if a middle schooler is reprehensible, it's because of some adult. Yeah, you could say the same thing for high schoolers, but high schoolers haven't learned. They're a little more self-aware and self-actualizing. Mm. And you are way closer to it than I am, because you are in high school. Of course, we have had the benefit of reflection, whereas you are still dealing with shit on a daily basis. Fucking aquarium. The clam chowder factory. They gave it. Uh, Liz. Oh, she just fucking talks shit about square pizza. The square pizza is pretty good. Yeah, I'm always deaf for a nice taste of square pizza. I mean, it's good for school. How come the square pizza's never had any edges? Because edges are the shitty parts. And no yeah, but how did they do that? Probably because of the dough that they used in the pan that they baked it in. I'm freaking out, man. <laughs> pizza with no edges. No, I just realized that the square pizza's never had any edges. <laughs> yeah, it's probably because, like, it came as, like, individual slices from the, you know, corporation that sold them. So, like, they didn't have well, an edge. Well, a lot of schools would make their own, though. Oh, I don't think so. How did I've the corporation seen, make it so there weren't any edges? I've seen I've seen recipes of like lunch ladies and stuff that have made them. Like they would actually make them in like big pans. Oh, yours had edges. Maybe we had a boot. Like maybe you were in like a different maybe, socioeconomic <laughs> class. The poor maybe, school's maybe. got all the edges. The bougie school's got all the centers. Did you say that you went? Did you say? Did you go to a private school? No. So but, then, what are you talking about? You went to a public school. I did go to a public school, but it was one where, like, literally, yes, ours were just cooked on a baking sheet. It was. It was a. You, make, you make them in a big batch and then you cut them into squares. That's how you can feed a. It was a lot of people. It was a public school where, like. A lot of people in the town were like pretty well off, so it seems like our school was also pretty well off. It's cause, probably because they were donating to the school. Yeah. Um, I don't remember ever having an edge piece of square pizza though. Do I really want to crawl down this rabbit hole? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's a health one. Uh, yeah, schools are funded by property tax, so the richer areas get better schools. It sucks. Jesus Christ. I just saw a fort morning, noon, and night sign. I mean, like, three different fort signs. 
I get to hang out with cool fish and cool dogs in this game. The ocean makes me nervous because one time I almost drowned. I totally hadn't done drugs beforehand. Don't do drugs. I've also almost drowned, but I literally did not do drugs beforehand. Are you worried a whale is going to swallow you whole? Don't you put fear in my heart? Being swallowed by a whale is the worst way to go. Hmm. Of course they do. What the fuck kind of aquarium do you think <laughs> oh, this is? So aggressive. <laughs> what the fuck kind of aquarium do you think this is? Of course we have penguins. <laughs> If I were running an aquarium and someone was like, do you have penguins? I would be so pissed. <laughs> I'd be Fuck. like, I'd hold up it's a penguin a and be like, we let them wander around the facility because they're so adorable. <laughs> Look at it. A kid asked you that question. Get this fucking kid out of my aquarium. I just throw a penguin at the kid. <laughs> just give me the stupid Yeet. question. Do we have penguins? Get this kid out of here. True. The penguins are my favorite part of going to the aquarium in uh, Chicago. Shit. We went in and there was just one penguin staring directly behind himself. <laughs> and he would not look away. And it was so funny because everyone was noticing it. And I was just making commentary like, man, I feel, I feel that. Cats and penguins can both see ghosts. Any animal can see ghosts, I think. I don't even need you. Listen, the world is a place that sometimes to deal with, you just have to scream. <laughs> Yeah. Especially if you are small. But if kids get to do it, why don't adults get to do it? Well, actually, you know, I take that back. There are adults who definitely will yell. Just usually it is at people and not yelling in general. So, never mind. Every December 2nd, I go out in a field and I just scream for hours. I work at a gas station. I experience that daily, <laughs> except usually I am the object of the person's frustration for well, something I literally can't control. You have to let those screams out. You want to join me on December oh, 2nd? No, I'm waiting till my last day there. Then I'm going to let the screams out. Nice. Yeah. I'm going to burn all those bridges. They're ten over kids here. Is not that bad. We're chaperoning a group of ten kids. They're over here. Mm. We're chaperoning a group of nine kids. They're <laughs> over here. <laughs> <laughs> the scream feels their blood <laughs> Yes. Our screams feed the corn. <laughs> they feed on our rage. <laughs> That is why our corns are so healthy. That's why that Slipknot album is called Iowa. It's just screams. Listen, no. First of all, Hugo, no. <laughs> yeah. The corn has ears for a reason. <laughs> to absorb your screams and use them for power. They're texting. I think the joke is that, like, adult all teenagers are like babies. If they're not making noise, it's a problem. We'll see. <laughs> They're planning to heist a shark. 
which, frankly, I would watch a shit out of a movie about heisting a shark from yeah. an aquarium. That'd be pretty awesome. Featuring middle school kids? Fucking forget about it, man. That movie's a hundred million dollar blockbuster. I don't know how much a movie has to make these days in order to be considered a blockbuster. It's a billion dollar blockbuster. That's probably a safe number to assume. Ah, uh, homework at the aquarium. I'm going to drown myself. <laughs> Free Willy, but it's a great white. Yeah, that's pretty much the thing. Also, fucking Ocean's Eleven didn't steal anything from the ocean. So fuck those guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You really it's a hard it. stance, but I'm sticking to it. It's almost like the guy's name was Ocean. Well, he didn't live up to it. What a disgrace. They didn't steal a shark either, I don't think. I don't know. I haven't seen that movie. Did they steal a shark? Yeah. They did. No, they didn't. Yes, they did. Safu, did Ocean 13 <laughs> steal a shark? I haven't seen any of those, so I can't. <laughs> Listen, I can't <laughs> prove anything. You can't prove anything, but you also up. don't trust me. I've got a phone right here. I can prove something. I'm going to say that Becca's just trying to mess with you and you're No, I'm almost stay. certain that's the case, but there's a possibility she's right, so I need to check. Oceans thirteen two thousand seven film Oceans thirteen hatch casino owner reversing okay no this is a casino heist it's not about sharks fuck it a liar. <laughs> Maybe the casino has a fucking shark. You dude. fucking liar. <laughs> liar. <laughs> Ask them to sit quietly for ten minutes. Listen. What are they learning though? Teacher hacks. I thought you were an English teacher. What does the aquarium have to do with books? Haven't you read The Old Man in the Sea? Fuck. Brush up on your classics. Stan. Hey, hey, look it. I did it. You did do it. Good job. You're clapping like a seal? <laughs> because of, you know, that they're in an aquarium. Yeah, it's all topical and all relevant, <laughs> right, and, I, not just, and not none just of you. it is the result of the alcohol. <laughs> not just you acting on intrusive thoughts that are now no longer inhibited because of the alcohol. Hmm. Yeah, I think you're right. None of it is because of that. <laughs> right. Got it. <laughs> Young man in the sea. <laughs> What does the young man catch? Is it free Willy? By which I mean Willy. Does Willy have a second name? Anyway. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? I don't know. I'm trying to bring it all together and it's all <laughs> falling apart. <laughs> that right there is a lionfish. Doesn't look anything like a lion. Did you Did know you their stomachs can expand up to thirty times the size? Big same. <laughs> I did that with pizza just now. You would be amazed. Their spines are venomous too. That's awesome. Nature is hardcore. Hardcore as fuck. Take your look at this one over here. What Just looking one? at it can kill a man. I also Whoops. like that they have the bubbles fish in the background from Nemo. The bubbles fish. The fish 
and Finding Nemo that's obsessed with bubbles in the dentist's office. Tank. I have not seen that in a while. Which color is it? Yellow. The one on the top right. Hmm. He freaks out over the bubbles. Bubbles. Yeah. The most venomous Stonefish. fish in the world. Me. You're not the most venomous fish in the... I don't think. Becca, why are you out of the water if you're the most venomous <laughs> fish in the world? Glug, glug. Oh no. Oh no. And they just like, keep it here? Duh. I, again with the lies, I don't know which lie you're referring to. I'm gonna guess he's referring to the lie that Becca told about Ocean's 13. <laughs> because you were dumb enough to think that it was true. Listen. <laughs> if... Here's the thing. If a series goes on long enough, it will jump, jump the shark. Sometimes literally. And so Ocean 13 very well could have been a movie about stealing a shark. I don't know. What happens if you step on it? You fucking die. Tissue necrosis. You gotta chop your leg off. Too bad, so sad, now you have one leg. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't have done that. Cool. Cool. This <laughs> is so fucking metal. I feel the oh no, or this is going to turn into another Brian situation where we fucking no. was like, yeah, I know everything about fish. Uh, fish swim. Oh, uh, Stan, why? <laughs> if I step on it hard enough, we both die. Know what, you dumb fish? That's a good bit. Blue nosed wiggly fish or the hump head wrasse. I like the wiggly fish the best. Well, the third one sounds like a real fish, but. So does the first one. Yeah. American long fin. I don't know, I feel like fish have weird names, so I feel like the third one is the, the best one. Did you know that? Psychiatric. I feel like paranormal is really in our wheelhouse. Yeah. Since we watch ice, fish, ghost, crab, trucker, paranormal, long haul, Jersey Shore, two. <laughs> two. <laughs> it's not actually a vampire. That's the vampire fish. Wait, are you serious? Absolutely not. <laughs> It's a bit! Just like everyone's existence. Just like the fact that I've been drinking. I'm sober as a judge. Oops, oops, is real. Sharks, sea turtles, eels. Eels are so fucking cool. Just saying. Sorry, that was a random. The other marine life is like. Oh. I also, like, I also like jellyfish. Jellyfish are red. Jellyfish are beautiful. That's like the most fun thing to go see in an aquarium. It's always cool. Seals are my second favorite because they're always hilarious. My side to separate two kids who started fight fighting over a Capri Sun. I mean, Capri Sun is pretty good, so I get it. I don't know why you would start a, a physical altercation over two no one said swallows. They were, no one said they were having a physical altercation. I don't know why you would start an altercation over two swallows. Let's think about the fight that we have, any of the swallows. fights we've had tonight. Most people <laughs> would say that all of them were stupid <laughs> and unnecessary. So maybe I those bitters... Do I need to say the word, Pete? Do I need to say the word? <laughs> Which word? The word. The word that brings up the pain. Is it past. teaspoons? 
And tablespoons. I'm just gonna say the word spoon. Listen, you can just use any spoon that is a teaspoon for a teaspoon. That's not correct. You're not correct. No, you're drunk and you're wrong. So I'm incredible. Oh correct. man, no, I'm that's talking a to Pete. that's a terrible state of affairs to be in. <laughs> drunk and wrong. <laughs> so you made the argument that a teaspoon is just any spoon. No, not any spoon, just a teaspoon, you know, like a small no, spoon. No, but he's saying that the argument was, that was made was that you could use any regular spoon as, as, a, as a teaspoon and any big spoon as a tablespoon, which is just wrong. Yeah, it really is. And Pete still thinks that, like, he's right, but I looked it's at it. It's, it's a literal measurement. <laughs> Yeah, and the small spoon, a scoop of the small spoon is about how much that measurement is. They're wildly different. There's You're different sizes of spoons. I thought you said we shouldn't bring it up, and then you brought it up, and now I'm talking you about it. You brought it up. I didn't say the word. You're you like, did. Hmm, should I say the word that brings up the past of our arguments that we've had in the past? Should I, should I mention it? No, I don't think I will mention the word spoon at all. You proud of yourself? No. <laughs> Good answer. <laughs> because pride is a sin. <laughs> <laughs> You've committed many sins. Don't lie to me. <laughs> yeah, but not that one. In the last five minutes. <sighs> the only way I can find peace is if I'm surrounded by angry hormonal preteens. It's like a schadenfreude thing. I see their angry hormonalness and I'm like, wow, I'm very peaceful by comparison. This is practically so nirvana. You must never have any peace ever because you're never around angry hormonal preteens. Damn, you're right. <laughs> Maybe I should be around angry hormonal preteens. Don't you yeah, have a you teaching can. degree? Yeah, teaching. I do, but boy, it would be a real pain in the ass to get all the certification. Hey, uh, the, the, the interview goes like this. Hey, didn't I see you drunk on stream one time? Yes. <laughs> no teaching job for you. Okay. Damn. Be. I feel like How this do whole you joke requires that people want. To I was learn. literally just gonna say not to be a bitch because I'm a bitch a lot of the time, but like not many people watch the stream at I, all. Currently, it's one. Yeah, which usually. Oh damn! I have committed the sin of pride. <laughs> well, now I don't even have that going for me. Seppuku. No. That's a bit of an overreaction. <laughs> okay. I feel like. Okay. I love that your theory that your last just voice cracks. No. Oh, no. God. What Listen, a fucking. You suggesting that I commit seppuku elicits an extreme reaction from me. You really? It's not the, what, eighth hard Mountain Dew that you're working on, perhaps? Nah. He looks really cute in this light. I hope he doesn't notice me staring, but he totally did. Oh God, what do I do? Um, there's nothing for it but to keep staring, really. Wow. 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 <laughs> wow. <laughs> All the preteens like pick up on that meme and they're like, wow. 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 It's like a, the fucking, Monster. once again, making a Nemo reference. It's and like the seagulls from... And he goes like, why are you all saying wow? <laughs> <laughs> and Steve's like, sorry. Bobby. Beautiful. Oh, no. Isn't it? This. Oh, no. Anemone. 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 Are those two sharks kissing? <laughs> Uh, I mean, I like the middle one. I like it, but I want to see what happens if we ask him if two sharks are kissing. <laughs> All right. 
Well, tell them to stop it. Their chaperone is not doing a very good job. Okay, that might have been the best sign I've ever seen. You mean Mother Ocean? Fuck, where's she at? She's rusty. Quite literally all around. Well, Does that mean she not. wants one shark to eat the other? Time for introspection. Because she sure, sure isn't intervening she's in any way. No armament ahead. What? So is this not a boss fight? Oh my god! Touch tank. Let's touch Let's some stuff. Race. I don't know if this is going to work here. For my well moisturized hands. Petting stingrays. my fucking runes. I have a lot. Petting stingrays is so fun. I'll take your word for that. Have you never done that before? Mm, I don't think so. I think I've been to one of these, but I never so petted the stingray. What am I, should I Why? Am I going it's to so fun. Like a, They're not dangerous. I, I can go leg, uh, kick the shit out of it very handily. Uh, if you have they the, finger, the frothawing finger remedy, they well, sting. Will not work. That's why they're called that. Oh, right. mm -hmm. Yeah, usually they either have the stings removed or it's like in a way where it's not going to sting you. It's not going to steam her when you don't worry about it. Do you suppose that there was a Deadpool being like, hey, which animal is going to finally do it steam her when? And one dude put like a dollar down on Stingray as a joke and like made a bunch of money? No, because that would make them a terrible person. A terrible person with a listen. There, this world is full of terrible people with a bunch of money. That doesn't mean you should. Uh, do you want to be one of those people? I didn't put any guy? money on this. <laughs> but most people don't want to be that person. Or I'd like to think so that most people don't want to be that person. Welcome to Earth. Trust me, I get you, it. Welcome to Earth. You need money to live. Have fun! Well, yeah, I get oh, that. Oh, it's me! Oh, okay. What if we quit, kissed and we were both aquarium sharks? Then it would be very... Shit, if I'd known this was the mimic here, I would have maybe have done this differently. Probably we would be upside down from each other. Which is not maybe a concept that sharks have a very good grasp of because they're sharks and they exist in a 3D environment. I can't anyway. wait for you to listen to this back and just be like, what the fuck am I talking about? Listen, <laughs> if you were a shark and you were swimming upside down, how well would you know it? What? <laughs> I'm too sober for you. <laughs> I was taking a drink. Why did you do that? I didn't think it was that funny. <laughs> I can't help that I'm a comedic fucking genius. <laughs> that question was so fucking stupid. I literally could not formulate an answer. Like... I took another drink just then. <laughs> this is a tragedy. I have impeccable timing, what can I say? So are top sharks and bottom sharks... Are bottom sharks the sharks that have to go upside down when they do a shark kiss? What? Cause sharks are shaped in weird ways. Yeah, their mouths are on the bottom. Zephu knows what the fuck I'm talking about. Mm. Don't I'm take. Sure that's a good or bad thing. I was just gonna say, don't take that as for agreeing yeah, with don't you. Don't forcefully lump her in with you. <laughs> I'm not lumping her in. I'm saying she knows what I'm talking about. No one knows what you're talking about. <laughs> Zephu knows what I'm talking <laughs> about. Talking you about. don't even know what you're talking about. Okay, I know what's happening. There's a grace here, but I can't. Jeff, that's not a good sentence. sentence. You should never be assured by saying that. <laughs> 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 Who eats that drunk? Right here, right, Jeff? Yeah. 
Okay, shark, like, right? Right where I'm standing. Yeah. Mouth on bottom of shark. Yeah. Sharks want to kiss other shark. Yeah. One of these sh sharks is going to have to be upside down from the other shark. Or they could be swimming up. Okay, that means one of the sharks. At different yeah. angles. Oh yeah, they could both be swimming up or swimming Yeah, they down. could just be like humans, but like... <laughs> or like they could both be sideways. <laughs> Are you also in, in the water. No, I just you know what I mean. Like, yeah, I do. I'm joking. So wait, would, would, Jesus would the, fucking Christ! <laughs> How many minutes of this stream? Which, is which, what are you talking about? Shark kissing. <laughs> Press the fucking X button. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Come on, it'll be fun and informative to talk about shark kiss kissing. Have a fucking mental breakdown. <laughs> Live on stream, Naomi's mental. I'm gonna have to retitle this this stream for clickbait. Live on stream, Naomi's mental breakdown. People don't care enough about me to care if I'm having a mental breakdown. That's not gonna be clickbait. But the SEO, Naomi. The what? Search engine optimization. You think people go on here looking for <laughs> breakdowns? Yeah, probably. So many of us are depressed. Well, that's what you think that's TV what we're gonna go for. look for? Mm. Yeah, that's what like. So many of us are sociopaths. Do you think that's what we're gonna go look for? Sociopaths is actually an outdated term, my prayer. <laughs> oh, already? Psychopath we... and sociopath are outdated. What are we? Antisocial personality disorder. Do you think they're not gonna search for break mental breakdowns on YouTube? No, because we. <sighs> No, because believe it or not, when I'm like not having a good day, I don't go looking for things that could possibly make my day worse, which would probably be someone having a mental breakdown. Oh believe it or not. I get weird when there's no glass separating us. Anyway, I'm going to need you to go into this glass room in my house. If we are going to have a sexy time. Because <laughs> he gets weird when there's no glass separating them. I need another glass of water. <laughs> yeah, you do. And possibly to go to the bathroom. Fuck. Everybody pretends like they don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> That's literally not it, Pete. I'm gonna fall over. <laughs> <laughs> How did that Your die? sentences are so convoluted that my ADHD clocks out midway through. It can't handle it. Got a short attention span, and you're not keeping it. I'm sorry, I'll try to be more engaging. Thank you. 
So what were we talking about? <laughs> Kissing shark stands glass encasement <laughs> fetish. The peace and silence was so nice. Uh. Speaking of bite, biting you in your delicious hands, where'd Brisket go? He's hiding from you. <laughs> No, I would never. No. See? Can we see the baby anemones? Anemones? Because the anemone of the anemone is my friend. Oh my god. <sighs> They're so cool. Fun, slimy leather. I wouldn't describe it as leather, but sure. Speaking of fun, slimy leather, what are you doing tonight? Oh, what? A <laughs> 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 horseshoe crab. Oh shit, this anemone is your friend because you and Hugo brushed hands while you were reaching for it. This anemone is a matchmaker friend. I'm sure is. trying my best <laughs> not to hiccup. <laughs> and it's not, not working. working. Whatsoever. Uh. Hmm. Hey, you're supposed to be touching the fish, not the ma mammals. Wait, let's hold hands under the water. That girl over there looks suspicious. Is it uh, Brian's kid? Our backpacks usually oh that way. Oh my god, they're trying to steal fish. Or probably a crab or something. Ocean's 14. Let's steal some fish. You tried. You really tried. <laughs> I succeeded. I feel like. <laughs> Aside from the hiccups. <laughs> Listen, sometimes bits get interrupted by hiccups, and that's just life, and you got to keep pressing onward. <laughs> hiccups are funnier than any bit you're doing. <laughs> it's part of the bit. What is it? Part of it. Part of it. <laughs> Susan, I was oh, I was hoping it was uh what's his name's kid? Brian's kid. Yeah, you <laughs> Textbooks. Sea urchin. <laughs> Listen, the world doesn't need any more bad cops. We've enough. got enough. Yeah. I'm not afraid to hit a child. <laughs> it's very wrong choice. It is, but it's really funny. <laughs> I think we should go with the middle yeah. one. Brisket baby. <laughs> Brisket uh, baby! He's here to eat hands and, uh, and please, take names. Please, 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 please sit in my lap. <gasps> yes! I brisket won. has sat in Naomi's lap. She has won the brisket lottery. This is the best day of my life. <laughs> Little brisket, brisket, brisket. Little baby boy. You're not a teacher. You can't tell me what to do. I'm a chaperone, and Hugo is a teacher. What's your argument here? It doesn't really make much sense. 
necessary item ahead. Oh my god, you're so cute. I love you so much. <laughs> What's in the bag? Look at your little fluffy paws. What if she doesn't have a fish? What if she has Gwyneth Paltrow's head? Like in that movie, which I can't remember the name of. Wait a wait a whiskey. I don't know. It was like seven or something. Somebody found a head in a box. But well, was it Gwyneth Paltrow? You just said Gwyneth Paltrow's head. Was it not? Whose head was it then? I don't know, but like the, the fact that you assumed that it was hers. <laughs> no, it was Gwyneth Paltrow's head. Was it? Yes. Are you for sure? It's some. Oh, it's somebody named oh, Gwen because boy. Borderlands have a re has a reference to it. Whiskey such a good boy. Yes. Uh, it was Gwen Paltrow. See, I know what I'm talking about occasionally. Once. I know what I'm talking about with teaspoons and tablespoons, and I know what I'm talking about now. Stop no, kicking that! Stop You're disturbing brisket. <laughs> what is in the bag? Sweet Manchego. Uh, a, a horseshoe crab. That's oh actually one God. of the and least to to the bottom? Oh. unreasonable things she could have picked. You're so cute, Brisket. Jesus Satan, what was your pl Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I thought we were being very... <laughs> I, no, I thought we were being creative with our swearing and being like, Jesus, Satan. <laughs> Jesus, Satan. For us normal people. Yeah. Listen, we shouldn't normalize being sober. <laughs> like that. Like that. <sighs> Frisky baby. I was trying to free no, him. please don't leave. No! Oh, brisket. The brisket lottery starts anew. <laughs> no! <laughs> Who will win this time? Looks like it's me. I'm the winner of the brisket lottery. I am going to commit seppuku. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought you were going to kill me because I won the brisket lottery. <laughs> oh, that's actually a better option. I will just kill you. No. Brisket. Do you think that will not disturb the brisket yet? <laughs> I would never do it in front of him. I would never disturb the baby. Okay, I'm locking my do my doors tonight. Or I'll just bring brisket with me. That's a better option. You realize it's my cat, right? Regardless. <laughs> Susan, go back. <laughs> he is baby. Go back to your group and don't steal any more fucking horseshoe crap. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Satan. Jesus, Satan. Hands where we can see. Mm. Why can't I stop hiccuping? I hate it. You must reap what you have sown. Seriously, Quit. You're, you're scaring the cat. Look you are. He's Keeps. licking your fingers. Every time you kick the box, it does freak him out. Genuinely, he was. <laughs> Look over here at the screen instead of at the scared kitty. Hey, no give birth. Men! <laughs> Seahorses. Everybody knows that, man. Let's see if Stan knew. Yeah, Stan's kind of dumb. <laughs> yeah. Listen, man, I've seen hundreds of videos of seahorses and also other males giving birth on the inter internet. Of, okay, you just wanted to get tangled in my wires? Cool. Brisket! Sweet baby! <gasps> He's so cute! I can't. I understand, okay? Earlier he was looking at me, he was, instead of sitting like this, he was sitting like that. And yeah. He He's so soft, too. He's very soft and floofy. Man, we thought we had it hard. Teenage seahorse. What? 
that sound like a show? <laughs> that kind of sounded like the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles theme song. Oh, I was bit. going for Teenage Wasteland, but all right. I'll take it. You seem to know a lot about marine life, Hugo. Yeah, I wanted to be a marine biologist, but I ended up as a fucking middle school literature teacher. How does that even happen? Hello. That's Hello. Colleen. That's Colleen. I know. Yeah. I also can't stay long because oh, we've been streaming for like four hours. Yeah, my laundry's actually probably done at this point. Yikes. Yeah. Learning shouldn't end when you leave school. If you stop learning, you won't be able to change or grow as a person. Come on. Teenage seahorse student parent. Heroes in a aquarium. Seahorse power. Risk it, I will kill people. I for still you. don't trust the ocean. Well, good thing this isn't that. We'll get. Th Sweet oh my boy. god. Sweet baby boy, brisk it. Oh no! You! No! So who I've cursed myself there. on accident. Oh no. I'm about to be virtual. Mistake of break, I happen to be near where I died. Virtual penguins. But I died from a height. So, no, no, we're dating Damien. We're just kind of like sampling the dads. Like when you go into a grocery <laughs> store and they're like, here, try this. You aren't actually buying anything. You're just sampling. Yeah, sweet Are you saying that, that you bought Damien? To yes. Make him a product. Do, do we get to see the penguins? Yes, we get to see the penguin. Just so you know, Colleen, yeah. Pete is about like seven or eight hard Mountain Dews in. So, Listen, what you're hearing is... I saw hard Mountain Dew and it made me giggle, so I had to buy it. And now, I am realizing the consequences. He sounds like a typical drunkard. We've joked that even I the streets know, won't even I have hate him. being so stereotypical, <laughs> but I can't control when I get the hiccups or not. I'm not doing this on purpose. It's a, we're joking. It's okay. I know. It's a joke. I know. I'm also joke. We're in on the bit together. <laughs> we're in on it together. It's like Ocean's Thirteen, <laughs> no, where they, the one where they steal a shark. Brisket, don't leave me, please. Well, I got him from, like, jumping up on Oh, Brisket, he licky my fingers. <laughs> Present him with your hand and you can have him lick licky your fingers, too. Um, as in, Mountain Dew came out with, um, like, hard Mountain Dew. Like, it came out with an alcoholic Mountain Dew. We got Baja Blasted. Yep, they have a Baja Blast flavor, a normal Mountain Dew flavor, and then there's a black cherry and a watermelon. Yep, that sure is what is in here, according to this box that I'm wearing on my foot. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, Colleen. Good luck with your opening. Yeah, watch this later when you don't have to open tomorrow oh, in, so, in a few hours. Yeah. Speaking of a few hours, I am going to go and check on my laundry. If it's dry, I probably should go home soon. Hugo says, hell yes, you should check on your laundry. Yeah, yeah. well, they re-released it, and this time it's alcoholic. Yeah, it was pretty popular. Night-night! Good night, good night Colleen. <sighs> oh, my God. <laughs> you were going to be so fucking... <laughs> I'm drinking water. Yeah, dude. I'm gonna ow. drink some more. I, you think drinking water is gonna cure your hangover in the morning? It's gonna make it less bad. It is gonna make it less bad. It will not cure it though. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nefu, thank you for sticking, sticking with me during the whole shark uh, debate. All I did was interpret what the fuck you were talking about. I, and I thank you for being my interpreter. Well, should I use my horse there? <sighs> so, can you do me a favor real quick? What? Um, can you show me on your map if there are any places nearby? Yeah, hang on. 
Wait, am I? But I'm not there. Am I? I'm you go, Hugo. Oh, okay. Do you ever take a drink or try and take a drink at exactly the right time to cure the hiccups? I guess maybe over here. I'm attempting it right now. Okay. It's not working. If you go back to the mimic hmm. go hmm. straight down here and then straight over here. The trick is you gotta do the drink right as you hiccup. Oh, you're back down at the base. Yeah, I'm at the bottom. Because, see, I had a drop and a drop down. Yeah, you don't do that. Why? Because you're you're aiming, you're trying Wait, to go over. Wait, am I back in Yeah. I've never been in this quick area, though. I tend to fix hiccups by doing focused breathing. Can you describe that exercise? Because there's only so much focusing I can do right now. I hold my breath sometimes. This is the back up to Caleb. Somewhere. And you're over in the middle here somewhere. Well, actually, right now I do kind of remember the smile. <sighs> brisket. He's such a soft brisket. Okay, it is getting really late, so I should probably go home. Okay, let's finish this scene, shall we? Quickly! Hell yes. Because I don't want to keep Zephyr out either. I, I go to bed at like 4.30. <laughs> yeah, I know, but you probably still don't want to be out on the road all that much. A few deliberate breaths in and out. Okay. No, I'm yawning, which is reasonable since it's like two in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> Hugo suddenly grabs my arm. That penguin. We have to free him. Oh my God! There's a student in the penguin enclosure. Is it your son? We just getting his very bad. Is it one of ours? Molly Henderson, Susan's friend. Fucking Susan and Molly. Are you gonna try and steal a penguin? God, this is this is Ocean's 14 or whatever the next number is. I'll create Hugo will create a distraction while we Everybody, 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 everywhere. Yeah? I have an announcement. Yeah. That's Hugo. Uh, these penguins are fucking rad. Here's a few facts I bet you didn't know about penguins. Penguins give each other shiny rocks as engagement presents. At least according to this documentary I watched called The Penguin and the Pemble, which is actually an, uh, an animated movie, but, you know, it's true. You can't be in here. Neither can you. Well, let's fucking leave then. Penguins are birds. Birds fly. Penguins do not. Even though they are birds. Ooh, epistemological questions. The crowd is still somehow enraptured. Wow. They deserve freedom. Yeah. That, hmm, that's a smaller space and warmer. Not until I save a penguin. Stan Van Halen is, he just puts on a beak and I'm like, you can save me, let's get the fuck out. 
penguins only live in cold climates that are not people's closets in the middle of whatever state this is. Do they not? There are a, I think there's a species that lives in Australia and some in some uh, further north in South America. Yeah, South America. Yeah, but are they like? They're not. They're they're still not like equatorial penguins. I'm I sure. I think they get that far, but they are far that I wouldn't specifically call it a cold climate. Did I mention that they don't fly? I think I did. They swim. I'm running out of time. Lay down the law, try to relate to her, or bribe her. Um, well, it's definitely not the first one. I feel like try to relate is probably going to yeah, yeah, probably. Hey, did you know that penguins <coughs> floss when they think no humans are looking? Anyway, let's get out of the penguin enclosure. Hey, my hiccups are gone. <laughs> Yay. Yay. Life can be cruel. Money. Give me money. Mm. All right. Fair enough. Boy, you are Should've not... Should with the bribing. No. Absolutely not. You are both terrible at negotiating. Oh shit, mini game time. Bird block. <laughs> Sleep is important, make sure you're getting enough. Well, oh. not at this rate, I won't. Oh god, what am I blocking? What is that? Is it a hand? Nope. Fuck. Nope, that was way off. Catch these hands, birds. <laughs> What do you mean penguin, penguin escaped? Es Where? Where? Why? How? Where did he escape to? You're gonna have to keep hitting him. I'm... Listen... I mean like... My hands are so fast... There must be a constant stream! <laughs> <laughs> Shit! Fuck! <laughs> oh my god! How many penguins are in here? Bribe that team! team. Oh no. Oh shit! Okay. Mission complete. Penguins have all of my money. <laughs> Alright, only two. That's not bad. And this teen doesn't get any money because the penguins have it all, but she should be... <laughs> she nice. should be satisfied with that because now the penguins will have a better life because they can afford uh, vending machine snacks? I only had $12. And that's why I think that penguins are one of the best animals in the world. Aww. <laughs> they surely are. Molly, what were you doing? <laughs> Listen, your name is one word off of, one letter off of vegan. You should understand that I am trying to free the penguins. This was not as good an argument as it sounded like when I was starting out. Anyway, penguins are good. They deserve to be free. You would have had a dead penguin. Uh, any plans the weekend of the 7th? I am in no state to answer that. I can barely understand the concept of five minutes from now. It's the thought that counts. You owe me eight dollars. What? Eight dollars? How are you ever gonna afford that? Um, I suspect that so they can compare it. Yeah, this was more like Oceans 2. You gotta have more people in a heist. Also, you can't be trying to complete separate heists while you're on the job. There needs to be one heist and more than two people. 
But not too many people or they'll start tripping over each other. Yeah. Unless you can get all the people. In which case, do that. <laughs> you just bribe. Stan, did you just bribe a child? Yeah, I do this all the time. <laughs> you can't play by the rules when there's penguins on the line. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not the young bright-eyed youth I used to be. Yeah, I only wish I could go back to the time I didn't know I had to bribe children to save a penguin. <laughs> I'm a lifesaver, sort of. Well, I didn't... I was... Oh, sure. fuck. A pizza is just a cheese board where the board is crust. No. <laughs> that is not what he means by that. I know. Charcuterie. I, just, I know what he meant by it. I was just, like, looking at a pizza and making a poignant observation. Poignant is going fairly far, but sure. Yes, well, sometimes I'm a prideful man. <laughs> yeah. Dude, I fucking love cheese. What the fuck is that? Becca made us some fried cheese earlier and it was delicious. Please don't slap my back hard when I'm, like, sneaking about, dude. Oh, shit, <laughs> man. I didn't know you were trying to be so stealthy. I'm not trying to be stealthy, I'm trying to not fall, and you slapping me. I did not. Kinda hard on the shoulder. It was a fat, it was a heavy. It was very heavy. You couldn't hold up your own hand type of situation. Becca made us cheese. <laughs> it was fat <laughs> somehow worse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You limp, sir. What you up to tonight? Just doing some homework? How was the aquarium? It was awesome. fraught. <laughs> but also, <awesome>. yeah. <laughs> We've, We've all, all been, been there. there. Wait, you've been there, Amanda? What the fuck? No, they die if you don't have them in cold. And I'm not paying for that air conditioning bill because I'm a dad. <laughs> Becca made cheese. She put cheese in the fryer and it was delicious. <laughs> kind of a stick in the mud. Yeah, this thing's, it's got to be alive because I can summon here. It's the same kind of thing as the regular CO for boss. It's the second one. What do you mean take a oh. nap? It's like dark out. Where do you? It's sleep it up, at that over point. Here? Why are we so lacking in water? <coughs> this dude needs to hydrate, and probably I do too. All right. Yes. I gotta go. Yes, you do, and I also do. And all these dads want to talk to us, but they're gonna have to friggin' wait. Whoa. Yeah, they're not fucking around. We are a hot commodity. The hottest of commodities. I'm going to double save for luck because that's how I do. Okay. And we will see you all next time. And I won't have the hiccups as bad, probably. Let's hope so. No guarantees, but probably. Bye. Bye.